Here at home, shots were fired in broad daylight in a busy area in North York this afternoon. The brazen double shooting on Lawrence Avenue West sent two men to hospital with serious injuries. The violence comes after a rash of shootings in the area over the past two weeks. Yellow markers and chalk outline bloodstains in the parking lot of a Wendy's near Dufferin and Lawrence. This is where police say the shooting started at 2.30 in the afternoon. Employees working inside shook by the news. It's really sad because we um, were inside and we didn't hear anything. It's just that somebody came inside and they said there was a shooting and stuff. Like, And we were all like, oh my God, that just happened and all of us inside, like, it's very sad. When police arrived, they located a victim inside a store near the Wendy's with gunshot wounds to his midsection. And shortly after, another victim at a second location with gunshot wounds to his lower body. The suspects are still at large. Do we know anything about whether or not the suspects knew the victims um, or if there was any connection with the two? Right. Well, at this time, there isn't a lot that we have on suspects, to be honest with you. Um, and it is something that we are actively looking into. Um, it is quite fortunate that not more people were injured given the time of day. It's a busy area. There have been seven shootings in and around the Lawrence Heights area over the past two weeks. Police releasing several surveillance videos of the suspects and suspect vehicles. The violent incidents left bullet holes in the windows of homes. But miraculously, nobody was injured in any of those shootings until today. Is it scary like being? It is. Of course it is because you inside and that happened. You don't know. Maybe the person could have come inside and, you know, shoot people inside of there. You never know. Police still aren't able to confirm whether or not any of the incidents are related. This community is dealing with a rash of this kind of violence right now. Any, any message to people who might be a little bit nervous? Well, we completely understand why people would be nervous. Um, it is um, unsettling to us as well. I know that 32 Division, the investigators, they're actively trying to basically find some answers to this and find the persons responsible for this. Police are appealing for witnesses in their investigation. They're asking anyone who may have been in the Lawrence and Dufferin area around 2 this afternoon to call them with information.